Rom Mantap Ayat Where do we go when we die? Where do we go when we die? Do we go anywhere? No, the question is intimately bound up in the distinction between body and soul. Many of us intuitively believe in a separate soul, reflecting perhaps our self-awareness as a special. Science, however, has yet to provide the definitive answer on whether we truly are a special species or whether our sense of the human soul is simply, simply a biological illusion. In fact, the whole subject of death is taboo area for science. So how do you say that we have therefore traditionally, traditionally looked to religion to provide the answers to the enigma of death? Due to our all too short lifespan, we need to believe in something. And this has proved an extremely fertile ground for religion. Given this need, or should I say well, vulnerability, it is not, as, not surprising that concepts such as heaven and hell have arisen without any logical foundation whatsoever. Minors indicate that these concepts are the invention of man drawn from the history and culture of the gods. This does not mean, however, that some kind of afterlife does not exist, and the concept of an immortal soul is the central issue. So he said, So in a matter of some debate whether the Bible supports of the concept of immortal soul or not. To the man in the street, any religion that speaks of heaven and hell must implicitly accept the idea of a soul. Resurrection. Resurrection. Mugong, 去復活回去,就看關於看個夢想的。啊,咁我去講起進教的本書來講聖書來講,聖書根本冇講關於冰狗的靈魂,冇,你講冇。They disagree that the Bible does not support the idea of an immortal soul and attribute its origin to a pagan intrusion into Christianity. Where then did the pagan idea of an afterlife come from? Terms such as hate, purgatory, paradise, and limbo are not found in the Bible but come from the Greek philosophy. And it is a well-known fact that the Greeks in turn obtained the idea from earlier cultures and in particular from Egypt. As we have seen, as we have seen in earlier chapters, the Egyptian, the early Pharaoh's belief in the afterlife was one of the strongest religious beliefs in the history of any civilization because tombs were unique for far surpassing anything from the Sumerian civilization. Their beliefs were so strong that they buried their dead with unprecedented, unprecedented possessions and treasures for use in the next life. It is fair to conclude that the concept of the immortal soul was an Egyptian first, which later spread throughout the ancient world. How 
only the Egyptian belief come about at the center of the Egyptian afterlife cult was the myth of Osiris. The essence of the tale is that Osiris died and was reborn. He was reborn in the sense that his seed was used by his wife Isis to create the sun, Horus. And he was reborn according to one version of the tale. After he ascended the stairway to heaven. Huh? Though these legions, Osiris came to represent the hope of eternal life to the Egyptians who made the pilgrimages to his cult center at Abydos and reenacted his life cycle. As I have already repeatedly, I have repeatedly described the Egyptian concept of heaven was a physical place which we can now identify as Nibiru, the door from which Osiris ascended to heaven was also a physical place, a place, a space center in the Sinai, and the route to the Duet was marked first by the pyramids and then later by Heliopolis. The Pharaoh's religion was based on evaluating the journey of Osiris using their own pyramids. One even uh, supervised by a Shem, Shem priest. The meaning of the name signifying the symbolic rocket, which is so graphically depicted in ancient Egyptian art, figure three, black and white section. The reason why this cultural resolution took place in Egypt is simply geography. The pharaohs were much closer to the comings and goings of the gods, gods in Sinai than the Sumerians were.簡單的說法,我說我是給的教授來的。他的背景,你知道教授的pyramid是什麼?教授很多東西,或者人都從山的人都是教授的。以前,alive,you know, this geography may also amount for the archetypal image of the phoenix rising from the ashes, which also its origin in Egypt. In, it is this event the Osiris ascend to heaven and the phoenix cycle of it, but which have caused the idea of an afterlife and an immortal soul to be passed down over thousands of years. In other words, they say that uh, uh, this idea has featured prominently in the history of religion. We have the claim restriction from that of Jesus. But this was disputed by the Quran, which is absolutely fundamental to Christian belief. Even more important is the idea of a future spell. The future physical resurrection and the Day of Judgment. The Quran spells that our quite explicit and the Bible too can be interpreted as, this, as the scene. Both the Bible and the Quran claim that the physical resurrection will occur in, uh, what call, in the coming Kingdom of God. We call, chun call, Two
多几多亿块，啊，如果佢都即係冇，佢要有啲喺度死咗咪等佢攞咯。呢、這個地地我都已經見到，二零二一年佢哋死咗，全部出嚟。所以嗰啲冇落執埋 ，actually 就係冇落執。你講 when the appointed time comes。All that have lived on earth will be physically resurrected from death and will be judged whether they are fit to enter the kingdom of heaven. This is Kong. To one day, he will be some, some people. Some people die. Then he will go to another place. Day one, he will die. 嗰啲復活，復活咗係審嗰啲人。誒誒，不過審得冇你講，來週來週冇審得冇，審唔到啦。哎，咁多人咗呢？後面死咗咁多，咁多，億億年啊！依冇唔通嗰個什麼復活變快肉體排隊？話我睇嗰陣時排下好多，你依冇主都唔得閒啊！好講啦。大次大次細大次死幾多人都好多啊！啊！石根窩窩嗰度死幾多人？係咯，點解計嗰條數？喺德國嗰度都打死幾多人？就係、是、嘅宗教信仰講復活啦，邏輯啦。啊，復活聽歌，你又 judgement 啦，聽嗰個日子咯。啊，即個你又 judgement 幾多？嗰個嗰個深厚嘅日子。According to New Testament, the kingdom of God will come when the times of the Gentiles are fulfilled. When, when the appointed time comes, all that have lived in Egypt will be physical, will be physically resurrected from dead, and will be judged whether they are fit to enter the kingdom of heaven. I li ai gong hei dei hei di ai kun shi di ai gam hei ge tiu cha gong you di ai gao hei gam ha ge ting du gai ren sei jo. 啊，去啊，主會嚟審起嚟啊！審起嚟邊個上天堂，邊個落地獄啊？咁樣啊，上天堂咧，第一咧，啊復活咧，嗰啲骨同埋肉咧，做乜啊？變翻個人，再正嚟審審邊個上天堂去地獄？好多好多好多好多咯！係啦，所以呢個唔得咁樣講啊，所以我我我講唔得嘅。So we seem to have acquired the idea that God is working to a very precise timetable. Put the reference to an age, therefore represent a pre uh, precessional period of 2,160 years, or could perhaps respond uh, represent the or orbit period of 3,600 years.